Our batter mixer and dispenser makes baking more fun and cleanup so much easier. It lets you mix all your ingredients and dispense batter from the same tool, making it an innovative all-in-one solution for easy cakes, brownies, and cupcakes. With this tool, you'll be able to mix a full box of cake mix in under a minute. So let's start baking. I'm going to use a classic cake mix to make cupcakes. You'll want to put in your wet ingredients first, then add your dry ingredients. It makes it easier to mix this way and the dry ingredients won't stick to the bottom of the barrel. Don't worry if the dry ingredients come to the very top, everything will still mix together. When you're ready to mix the batter, pump the mixer handle until the ingredients are completely mixed. Then remove the lid by holding your index finger on the mixer handle to keep the plunger in place and twist. Put the dispenser cap on. Then put the plunger in at an angle to remove air. Twist on the lid and select your dispensing amount. I'm going to use the large dot for cupcakes in my muffin pan. The medium dot is great for pancakes and the small dot is perfect for mini cupcakes. Now take off the silicone base and start dispensing. You don't need to apply extra pressure to the trigger, just gently pull. The portion selector lets you dispense the perfect amount of batter every time and keeps the portions consistent so that your treats bake evenly. When you're done, you have to release the pressure. Just pulling up on the mixer handle won't work. You'll need to twist the lid, put your finger in the dispenser valve, and at the same time, pull up on the mixer handle. One of the best parts about this product, it's dishwasher safe. All you have to do to clean it is remove the lid, place your fingers on the ridges of the inner plate, and twist counterclockwise. Slide the plate down the metal rod and keep the plunger on so everything stays in place. Place the barrel, lid, dispenser cap, and silicone base in the dishwasher away from the heating element. If the dispenser valve is still dirty, just rinse it in the sink. Then put it back in the barrel with the flat side facing up. To put the lid back together, make sure the rectangular metal lever is aligned with the plastic slots and the long side is facing the handle. Then slide the inner plate up, align it with the tabs on the lid, and twist. You'll hear a click when it's secure. When the silicone base is dry, put it back on the bottom of the barrel. Place the dispensing cap in the barrel and tighten the lid. Now that you see how easy it is to bake with this one tool, you'll never bake the old-fashioned way again.